Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January 2nd of 2023. Well, it is titled After Sunset Planet Parade. So what do we see here? Well, here is an image of the evening sky taken just a few days ago and looking at the number of planets that are visible in the evening right now. Now we can see some of them here. You can imagine that some of these brighter objects are probably planets, but let's go ahead and uh, label them for you so you can go ahead and see what is visible. And that is, we can see if we start off on the left hand side, we see the planet Mars, the red planet, uh, way off to the side there. And then as we work our way through, we see a couple of other planets, you'll note that Uranus and Neptune are in blue, because while they're visible, they're not visible to the naked eye. And we also see Jupiter up near the top. Now there's also a few stars labeled there and we see that Mars is in the area of the constellation of Taurus the bull and we see the bright star Aldebaran there as well and that's part of the Hyades star cluster and then above and just to the right of Mars is the Pleiades star cluster. Now over toward the right hand side we see far more planets as we look over toward the uh, toward the sunset off there on the right side, we see the planet Saturn, which is slowly sinking into the sun, uh, not literally, but as we see it from Earth, it will be getting closer and closer to the sun and less visible over the coming days and months. And it will slowly disappear. Then as we get down toward the horizon, we see the elusive planet Mercury, probably the toughest planet to be able to see. Uh, that is actually visible with the naked eye. And that's because you can only see it when it is at its furthest distance from the sun, which is never very much. So it is only above the horizon without the sun up for a very short period of time at specific times of year. So it's very difficult to be able to catch simply because it is often lost within the glare of the sun. And then just over above the horizon we see Venus. Now Venus is often very prominent and has been a very prominent morning star for much of this past year. But it slowly starting this fall started to sink into the direction of the sun and now has emerged as the evening star. Now it's not easily that super easily visible, but it'll be getting better and better over the coming weeks and months and we will soon be able to see Venus very prominently in the night sky over much of this spring. So by the time we get to April and May, Venus will be extremely prominent in the night sky, in the night sky shortly after sunset being the brightest object that we see there once the sun has gone down. So a lot of planets out and visible right now in the evening sky. Venus will be getting more and more prominent while Saturn will be getting less and less as it slowly continues its path which moves it closer to the direction of the sun in the sky. So that was our picture of the day for January 2nd of 2023. It was titled After Sunset Planet Parade. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be stars align. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.